<laughs> the last three pieces. It's like these are the pieces to finish the tortoise house. Twelve thirty-six inch. Twelve thirty-two inch. What do you think? Yep, I know. So in this video, you guys will see me basically finish the walls of. Uh, the tortoise house. Stay tuned. So, I marked off where I'm gonna drill the holes for the screws. So it'll be one, two, three, four, five, six. Six on one side, six on the other side. And then after I screw everything in, I'll go out to those and do the middle pieces. So now that we have all the screws in, now I'm gonna flip this thing. You there, you. Yes, I'm talking to you, little mans. Little mans, what are you doing? Now I gotta flip that on the side so I can start putting those two by fours as panels. Honestly, so anyone else thinking about doing a tortoise house, two by fours are way cheaper than these, uh, I think they're 48 by 48 plywood. These are like 40, 50 bucks a piece, whereas a 12 foot two by four, I think it's like what was it 12 bucks 13 bucks something like that so yeah if you think about building one uh two by fours are the easier route to do and the cheaper route to do and i feel like they're way more sturdy but now i'm gonna drag this out for put on the side and yeah
gonna have to figure out how to get a slice of that. Removing the, I don't know. So, this doesn't fit flush as you can see. So, I literally have to run the saw and cut right about there up into the screw all the way down so it'll fit flush with this. But for now, I'm gonna grab the drill and screw everything else in. I'm almost destroying that one area because I may have destroyed it on the way out of the greenhouse. But yeah, let's go get this off. So now the back wall's in. I'm gonna drill one hole per, screw them all in, and do the front. And get that all set up so I can get my door designed and ready to go. And something sounds like it just fell over. Uh, but yeah, I got the sides on that side. I got the sides on that side. Coming all together. Let's see if the big one breaks. So on these last back panel pieces, there's gonna be the gray screws. And on the front, I'm gonna do the black wood screws. So it kind of make it look like a little, a little tortoise barn, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? Do you know what I mean? But do you know what I mean? So now I need to get a jigsaw, cut that out. Cut that out. This will be where the door goes. I just need to measure and cut these. Two. So that one. And that one. Oh, look at that. Those three extra pieces might be the three pieces I needed plus these and stacked. You're on the home stretch. Got my fancy black screws. Obviously, this is probably gonna be part one. And then part two would be getting a lock for this, making a door, making a locked door, cutting this, and Probably gonna put a heat panel up there, a radiant heat panel. Um, but yeah, let me just get the last dish stuff done.
Nice. So now I have my door. It opens up like that. Look how smooth and clean it looks. I would say this is probably my best tortoise house that I've built. And I built three of them. 3.0 looking better than everything. Um, yeah, I think I like it like more like this. Looks more like a cabin feel. And then I need to insulate certain things, but I'll do it on a drier day. So part one, done. The walls are up and everything. Part two will be insulating it, putting a lock here, making a door, making a lock there, cutting this out. And yeah. Hope you guys enjoy this video. Let me get out of the darkness. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, share. When you subscribe, also hit the bell notification because it helps me out. And thank you for the, what is it, 198 subscribers? Almost 200 before the end of this month, which was my goal. So, yeah, getting goals done, getting stuff done. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day, rest of your week, rest of your month, and I'll see y'all later. Peace.